What kind of traveler are you? A planner or a spontaneous adventurer? Welcome aboard. Today, we're setting sail on a journey of discovery, navigating the vast seas of travel options. We're going to delve into a common conundrum that many wanderlust souls grapple with, the choice between a meticulously planned tour or the thrill of independent travel. From convenience to freedom, security to authenticity, we'll weigh the pros and cons of each. So buckle up, let's dive into the exciting world of travel and explore the pros and cons of both options. Imagine having everything prepared for you, your accommodations, your meals, and your daily activities. Sounds convenient, right? This is exactly what tours offer. They take the guesswork out of travel planning, freeing you from the hassle of logistics and allowing you to focus on the experience itself. Tours are like well-oiled machines, efficiently planned to maximize your time and ensure you don't miss any must-see sites. They provide a structured itinerary, complete with local guides who are skilled in sharing the rich history and culture of your destination, providing a depth of understanding that's often hard to achieve on your own. But it's not just about convenience. Tours also offer a sense of security, particularly when you're exploring unfamiliar terrain. They ensure you're traveling safely, adhering to local customs and avoiding potential pitfalls. This can be particularly reassuring for first-time travelers or those visiting destinations with complex cultural nuances. Moreover, tours can be a social butterfly's dream. They offer the chance to meet like-minded travelers, to share experiences and to forge lasting friendships. These shared memories often enhance the travel experience, providing a sense of camaraderie and connection that can be hard to find when traveling alone. Tours can make your journey smooth and hassle-free, but let's not forget the other side of the coin. Whether you're a seasoned globetrotter or a travel novice, the choice between tours and independent travel ultimately hinges on your personal preferences and what you hope to gain from your journey. Picture this. You wake up in a new city with no set plans. You have the freedom to go wherever your heart desires. Exciting, isn't it? When you're an independent traveler, the world is your oyster. There's nothing quite like the thrill of navigating a foreign city all by yourself, armed with nothing but a map and a sense of adventure. Independent travel opens up a world of possibilities. You're free to wander off the beaten path, discover hidden gems, and immerse yourself in the local culture. The beauty of independent travel lies in its flexibility. You have the liberty to change your plans on a whim. If you stumble upon a quaint little cafe or a breathtaking viewpoint, you're free to linger as long as you please. You're not bound by a strict itinerary. You're free to follow your instincts and your interests. Moreover, independent travel allows for an authentic and immersive experience. You're not just a passive observer. You're an active participant. You're not just ticking off landmarks on a list. You're living and breathing the experience. The allure of independent travel is undeniable. It offers a unique, personalized adventure that's tailored to your tastes. You get to live out your travel dreams, on your terms. Independent travel can offer a unique experience, but it's not for everyone. It requires a certain degree of confidence, resourcefulness, and a willingness to step out of your comfort zone. But for those who embrace it, independent travel can be an incredibly rewarding experience. So, tour or independent travel, which one suits you best? Let's recap what we've covered. Tours offer a hassle-free journey with everything planned out for you, from accommodations to activities. They provide a sense of security, especially when you're in unfamiliar territories. Plus, they can be a fantastic platform to meet new people and make lasting memories. On the flip side, independent travel presents an opportunity for freedom and flexibility. You can tailor your itinerary to your liking, allowing for a more personalized adventure. It also enables a more authentic and immersive experience as you get to interact directly with the local culture and environment. But there's no one-size-fits-all answer here. The choice between a tour and independent travel ultimately hinges on your travel style and preferences. Are you someone who appreciates the convenience and camaraderie of a group? Then a tour might be your best bet. But if you crave the thrill of charting your own course and immersing yourself in a new culture at your own pace, independent travel could be the way to go. The world of travel is vast and varied, and there's room for every kind of explorer. So, whether you're a seasoned globetrotter or a first-time voyager, the key is to find what works for you and embrace it. Remember, whether you're on a tour or exploring independently, the most important thing is to enjoy the journey. Thanks for tuning in, and don't forget to subscribe for more travel insights and inspiration.